American citizens at the behest of our intelligence community? I don't have any information on that. Sir. You don't have to be an Alex Gutentag cite sources in the intelligence community that say that the I security to that end has Iran's uranium enrichment well beyond what is needed for nuclear energy production continued during the last three years? Um, Iran has, has uh, most recently they have been increasing their uh, production to about 60%. Is that, is that what's needed for peaceful nuclear power production, 60 percent enrichment? We, what I can say is their activities are not ones that make us understand that what they're doing is peaceful. I'm sorry, say that last part. They're, we're, we're, our assessment is that what they're doing is not considered a peaceful. Right. It's Obviously, 60 percent has nothing to do with uh, pr uh, peaceful power production. It has to do with weapons production. Mm -hmm. Are you personally involved in any active discussions with Iran on non-proliferation? Proliferation. We are not involved in any uh, activities right now. So what is the plan, if you can, uh, generally speaking, not asking for any classified information, but how can we uh, assure the American people of, of some plan, any plan, to stop Iran from having a nuclear weapon that mm -hmm. they will deliver via ballistic capability? Right. Well, first I want to uh, thank the question, just to highlight, first of all, that, you know, we are always looking for a diplomatic solution. And that's always the first thing. And of course, we're having a problem with that right now because there really is no uh, good solution on the table. We continue to uh, work, uh, work with the IAEA, International Atomic Energy Agency, and their efforts to try to assess what's happening um, in Iran. We, and we know, know what's happening. Now, I'm asking what the plan is because they're moving forward. They're doing it the plan as we speak. Is, yeah, the plan is to continue to seek diplomatic resolution okay. on it. All right, so they're going to continue, and we're going to keep talking, and they're going to continue. I got it. I just wanted mm -hmm. to see if there was something new here that I wasn't aware of. I want to switch subjects here a little bit. New reporting from Michael Schellenberger, Matt Taibbi, and Alex Gutentag cite sources in the intelligence community that say that the IC asked five eyes intelligence agencies, including the U.K. and Australia, to spy on 26 of the previous administration's associates. Do you know if a warden existed to authorize the spying on these American citizens at the behest of our intelligence community? I don't have any information on that. Sir. You don't have any information? Well, okay. Do you and the president support the requirement of a warrant to have Five Eyes intelligence agencies spy on American citizens on America's behalf? Do you and the president agree that a warrant would be required? Um, I'm hesitant to respond to that because I don't feel like I have enough of the background information that you're... Okay, well, your if I don't include the president, if I just include you, do you believe in warrantless spying at the behest of the intelligence community on American citizens? I'm not quite sure how to respond to that. I mean, we, we do want warrants if there's going to be spying done, but I'm not sure I can answer that question. You I can't. want to be honest with you. I don't feel Would you Would you like the intelligence community to be authorized to spy on you without a warrant? Uh, no, I would not. So then would you be able to transpose that desire of yours for yourself to other American citizens who would like the same constitutional protections that you apparently want for yourself. I, I can tra I, I, I assume that others would want that, but I'm not sure that I can really say what, what the U.S. position is because I'm not I'm, sure. I'm not asking for the U.S. position. I just asked for yours and if you know what the president's is. So yours for yourself is you want the, war the protection of the warrant, yes, but you can't say yeah. for other American citizens. I would imagine yes. Okay. Yeah. I'll take yes as an answer. Let me... Let me just uh, posit one other thought to you. I look at your uh, testimony here, and uh, we proposed, as you said, a, and passed a United Nations resolution calling on countries to not conduct destructive direct uh, sent satellite, anti-satellite missile tests. Did China agree with that? China, we have approached China with that. I know. Um, we have not had a real uh, in-depth discussion with them on that. You haven't had what? We haven't had an in-depth discussion with them on that, but we have approached them about that, and we're open to them being a part of that. Oh, I'm sure we're open to it. I'm sure they're not open to it, which, which concerns me, because further in your testimony, you talk about the United States um, destroying the, the, the stockpile of the entire category of declared weapons of mass destruction. Mm -hmm. So we're leading by destroying 
our defensive capabilities and offensive capabilities while hoping that China will come along and, and, and discontinue their offensive capabilities. I will tell you, ma'am, what we're doing is unilaterally disarming, hoping that China is going to play along. They're not going to play along. I yield the balance. Thank you very much, Congressman Perry, and I think it's very appropriate your uh, talk, and, and they're going to continue. I got it. I just wanted mm -hmm. to see if there was something new here that I wasn't aware of. Doing is not considered a peaceful. Right. It's obviously 60 percent has not American citizens at the behest of our intelligence community. I don't have any information on that. So you don't have peaceful. I'm sorry. Say that last part. There, where, where our assessment is that what they're production. Mm -hmm. Are you personally involved in any active discussions with Iran on? Did you know if a warden existed to authorize the spying on these Americans? Because there really is no uh, good solution on the table. We continue to uh, and say is their activities are not ones that make us understand that what they're doing is beyond what is needed for nuclear energy production. Continued during CS Five Eyes intelligence agencies, including the UK and Australia. Security to that end has Iran's uranium enrichment well. -bearer. I want to switch subjects here a little bit. New reporting from Michael Schellenberger, Matt Taib. Well, first I want to uh, thank the question. Just to highlight, first of all, that you know we are always uh, production to about sixty percent. Is that is that what's needed for? Oh, no. So, what is the plan, if you can, uh, generally speak? Work uh, work with the IAEA, International Atomic Energy Agency, and their efforts. For peaceful nuclear power production, sixty percent enrichment. We, what I.